To the glory of God. That's why we will not stop thanking God. Because he keeps multiplying all our blessings. We have all other special thanksgiving. People celebrating their marriage anniversaries. Celebrating their birthdays. You know, celebrating every good thing that God has done for them. We have some of our pastors leading those, those teams. Three of our pastors are here, including the associate pastor and some other pastors, and four deacons here, and some other family. And numerous blessings, new businesses, new job, new, you know, breakthroughs, and all that. Dedication of houses. God is so good. Don't you think we should thank God? <laughs> Hallelujah. So if you see us singing and dancing, it's not our fault. Praise the name of the Lord. In case you are dancing and dancing, somebody is looking at you with one eye. Tell him, no be my fault. <laughs> Praise the name of the Lord. Every blessing of God is meant to be preserved. Each time we return back in thanksgiving is to preserve the blessing. Praise the name of the Lord. Preserve the blessing. So anytime we return to, back to God, we are coming so that he can preserve the blessing. Praise the name of the Lord. Preserve the blessing. So thanksgiving is not just something that is done without meaning. Do it with understanding. Praise the name of the Lord. For everything you thank God for. And when you are thanking God, thank him in deed and in truth. So when you see all manners of attires and colorful attires here, don't be angry. Praise the name of the Lord. It's just to show that God has beautified the life of everyone. He has given color. Praise the name of the Lord. The LCC chairman is uh, looking like a chief. Praise the name of the Lord. I, uh, I need to know how to go and tie that rapper. Praise the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. And we see some wonderful people here looking good. To give God the glory. 
When God is excited, he keeps blessing his people. You are thanking God for these children today. You will not weep over them. They are for signs and wonders. They will not bring shame to you. In the name of Jesus, they will fulfill their destiny. They will outwit all their contemporaries. None of them will end up in prison houses. None of them will end up on the streets. They are children of the Most High God. They will live long. You will not bury them. In the name of Jesus, they are preserved. No evil eyes will see them. No evil hands will touch them. In the name of Jesus, you are thanking God for your birthday, for your wedding anniversary, for that new business, for that new contract, for that new job, for preservation of life. Whatever you are thanking God for today, I decree it will not be a source of sorrow to you. The blessings of God make it rich and added no sorrow. Whatever you are thanking God for today, you will not sorrow over it. In the name of Jesus, your eyes will see many more years. Glorious years. Fruitful years. Years full of testimonies. That business will not die. That new job you got, you will not lose it. Your birthday, you will see many more years. Your wedding anniversary, you will see many more years in hands. Whatever it is that you are thanking God for is blessed, is preserved. In the name of Jesus, and everyone that have come to share the joy of these families, joy will not leave your own habitations. You will have occasion for your own joy and blessings. In Jesus' mighty name, your offerings that you have brought unto the Lord is blessed right now. It will multiply. In Jesus' mighty name. Can I hear louder? Amen. Congratulations. You will dance back to your seat right now. Hey. Congregations. Congregation, please get set. We are rising up generally after this to give God the general thanksgiving for the end of month thanksgiving for the entire church. So prepare your thanksgiving seat. We'll soon be rising to do that now. Shout hallelujah. Very shortly, we are all going to rise up and give God thanks for making our eyes see the last Sunday of the second month of this year. As our custom is, as a commission, every last Sunday of the month, we return back to God in thanksgiving, in response and in obedience to scriptures. You know the story of those ten leopards in Luke 19? When they met Jesus and they were healed, and the Bible says one of them, as he was going, he saw that he has been healed. He turned back. He didn't even get home. That shows you how important Thanksgiving is. He turned back and met Jesus at the same spot. And Jesus said, where are they now? It means that he was waiting for them. 
Anytime God has done anything good in your life, He is waiting for you to come and thank Him so that He can perfect the blessing. When He does the good, it's not finished. That's just part A of the blessing. When you return back in thanksgiving, part B, He completes and perfects the blessing. So that's why every last Sunday we return with a heart of thanksgiving, with a seed of thanksgiving to come and thank God. That's why our blessings keep multiplying. That's why he preserves the blessing. Very shortly, with our seed in our hands, we are going to rise up and give God qualitative thanksgiving. He has spared our life. He has done all things well. That you are not in hospital alone is enough to thank him. That you are not in the grave is enough to thank him. Even if you feel God has not done anything, that you didn't, they didn't carry you, you brought yourself here today, is enough to thank God. Will you thank God? Rise up on your feet. Lift up your voice and thank him from the depth of your heart. If you brought a seed, lift it up unto the Lord and thank him and give him praise. As give him praise and thank him and thank him. Jesus will thank you. You have done all things well in my life. Thank you, Jesus. Blessed be your name, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name we are prayer. Lord, we have returned in thanksgiving because you have done all things well. We join our hearts. We this seed in our hands. We say thank you. Preserve our blessings. Multiply our blessings. In accordance to your word. Let everyone thanking you today. Let them see this time next month. Let them see beyond next month. Let them see the end of this year. And more beyond this year. These seeds are blessed. It will multiply your hands. You are thanking God. Every other blessing is perfected. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hallelujah. I'd like you to dance your dances to God. As we thank him, choir will give us a hot song and then we give him praise and dance. Hallelujah.
Come on, give him shout. Because you have praised the name of the Lord your God for all that he has done, your blessings are preserved in the name of Jesus. Your blessings multiplied in the name of Jesus. Nothing will go down in your life this coming month in the name of Jesus. Strange doors of blessings shall be opened unto you this month. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name. Come on, give him a loud shout. Give him a loud shout.